Shalom, and welcome once again to another episode of Elders of GMS, giving all praises to, to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Uh, today's topic is entitled, Understanding Spirits and Demons. And uh, the reason why we're going to go through this, because a, a brother uh, had had sent a, uh, uh, a message uh, to us concerning... Um, you know, demons. He's he seen demons. He had experienced demons attacking him, and he's a little shaken up by it. Uh, so um, we had responded back to the brother saying that don't worry, we're going to cover it in the next show. Um, basically, he put it in letter form, and it's a little long, so I don't want to get into it. But that's basically um, the letter is basically saying that he what I just said. You know, he's uh, experiencing these uh, demons attacking him. And um, we all go through that. We all get jumped by demons, all right? You know, when you're half asleep, the demons hold you down. When you can't speak, you can't move, you have to fight them in the spirit. Because now we're in the time, when you come into this truth, you can't stay on one level. You got people in there that just watch videos and they think that they're, they're part of the elect. Part of the elective is doing the work of the Most High and growing in the spirit. You're supposed to grow in this thing. Not knocking that brother, but the, the cure for you is to grow in these scriptures, to read these scriptures, to watch the videos, and to let the videos sink into your, into your, uh, your belly, so to speak, and read those scriptures and understand them precepts. And, build, and you got to build yourself up in the faith. All right. Like I said, that's not just to him. That's for all of y'all. Some of you uh, brothers out there have been in this thing for three, four years, and um, you can't be on the same level that you was when you when you was you, ha you had your first six months in this thing. You got to be on a higher level. You got to understand the spirits. Oh, I'm gonna say this too. A couple of the young brothers in our camp. Uh, this woman. She was being possessed by demons. Her house was being possessed by demons. And she basically came to me. And I basically got a handful of brothers that lived kind of close to her. And I said, well, you brothers, I'm going to put you on a mission. They had nervous looks in the, on their faces. And they kept saying, well, what kind of prayer do we do? What do we do? I said, look, man, y'all been in this thing long enough. You figure it out. And um, from what I heard, they had went to the women's house finally. And um, they had put up the prayers and they actually felt the presence of the demons leave right out the window i didn't get a chance to actually talk to them but you know what that did that built up their spirit even more because experience is what experience is something that you go through and that you do you know uh so it's, it's not something that you read it's something that you actually physically do when you do it, you have that experience. So them brothers have the experience of uh, uh, exercising um, a house, you know, exercising demons from a house. And I had told them brothers that we did an exorcism of a whole building. And even uh, Gehenna was there. Cause, so you can ask him, he'll, he'll tell you. All right, me and him was young, young in the truth, and we were like a little nervous. At the thing, it was Masha, uh, uh, Aria, uh, uh, Shaw, and the rest of the so called top brothers. I'm not, and there was a bunch of us, man. And we had to exercise a six story building, you know, exercise the demons out of that building. And one of the men that he was, the guy actually owned the building, and he had brought in evidence that there were demons in the building. Um, he had a uh, uh, pictures because he found out every morning the garbage cans were pushed over, and he had took pictures of the garbage cans. And when it and, and when the pictures were developed, he saw he saw uh, uh, fires, like uh, like fire sticks, in one picture. Then then the next picture, the fire sticks turned to the form of human bodies, turned into it was like three. It was like a little small one and two big ones, and um. Yeah, that's Hebrews. I know where you're going. Hebrews one, which I already got in the list. All right, but so so that's how we knew that those were spirits or demons, because spirits come in the form of fire. Because fire is what pure energy. 
What's in your body is a spirit. So why should you get be afraid of other spirits? You're a spirit. But but see, being in Esau's system, they don't teach you about that. 